I get asked regularly uh, by people about the best way how to wrap your hands. A um, nice trick I like to use, I like to use a sponge. Um, it provides a lot of protection for your knuckles, it'll just preserve your hands for a lot longer. Easiest way to do that, you take the sponge, take it over here, and get it in the position on your knuckles. From there then it's just nice and simple to go around your hand, around your thumb, around your wrist, and then you want to be coming in between and back to the middle, in between, back there, and in between until you've done it for all your fingers. And from there then after that you can just wrap around and then go to the wrist, make that pretty tight and that should leave you with a nice solid, the sponge is there, a nice good protection, protection for the wrist and for the knuckles. Okay, we're just going to go over that hand wrapping again. So again, we've got the sponge. I'm going to take that over the knuckles to make a nice, nice solid pad. I'm going to go around from there twice. And from there, we're going to go down to the wrist. From the wrist, we're going to go to the thumb. And back around the wrist again. And then we're going to go through each of the fingers individually. First one, then come through to the middle. Back to the wrist. Through the fingers again, back to the middle back to the wrist and then through the last gap and then back to the wrist again and then from there you just want to be going round make sure the wrist is protected and padded as well as the knuckles are if you want from there you can go around the thumb again all depends on what area you are trying to protect so from there we've got a nice solid base knuckles protected wrist protected